In this video, I made Flappy Bird inside of Roblox. Now, if you don't know, Flappy Bird was a very popular mobile game released in 2013, but it was then banned in 2014 because it was that addictive. Anyways, let's get on with the video. So, the first thing I did was make a play button to start the game. And once I'd done that, I got straight into scripting it. And then, I started making my own version of the pipes in Flappy Bird. And once I've made those, I started scripting the map generation. And it looks something like this. But then, I decided that I wanted to remove the play button, and just make it so the player had to press space to start. So I changed my text button into a text label. And then, I started making the player itself, which was just a yellow block. And then, I started trying to script the movement of the player when space was pressed, but I just couldn't get it to work. So eventually, I moved all of that to be server-sided, and then it worked absolutely fine. And then, once I'd done that, I made the bird actually move forwards, and there were no issues at all. None! But to fix that, I had to make it so when you touch the pipes, you'd die, and it would restart the game. But I thought that was a bit boring, so I added a death message. And then, I just polished some things up to make the gameplay a bit better, and then, it was done. So this was the final product. I think it went pretty well, given it didn't even take me an hour to make. And if you want to play the game, I'll leave a link in the description. It's called Flying Block. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.